Hey guys, Jeff Moss here again, Diverse Dimensions. I wanted to do another example of this reviewer and uh, kind of a chill vibe here today, coming close to the holidays. So we have the Christmas Lounge playing in the background on Soma FM. It's always a good way to chill here as we do some of these videos. But I wanted to show you this the second example of this uh, reviewer. And I've got the same file here that uh, the previous was done on this workspace, this reviewer trial workspace. Right clicking on there again to pull up the reviewer since I don't have a license of Polyworks attached here. And again, it blinks quick and pulls up this manager. And then it gets into the reviewer here and it'll pop into the uh, the project here. It'll show all the, all the parts, all the features, every part of the CAD. But I wanted to show this as an example of how we can pull another project in that is under this workspace. So let me show you this. I'll pull back into this little icon here, which is the workspace. This is the reviewer trial workspace. And there happens to be just another project underneath here. So some of these workspaces will contain multiple projects. And then under each of these projects, there might be multiple pieces under these projects. But notice this, the core analysis is what is currently open. You can see that it's locked right here with this little icon, looks like a uh, padlock. And that isn't the uh, the analysis I wanted to see. I wanted to see this cavity analysis. This is where some other, uh, this is where the scan actually was. So I wanted to pull this up. So I came into the workspace manager here. Then I right click on it. Or I'm sorry. I left mouse click twice as if I was going to fire this up. And notice this error comes up. It, does, it says you um, don't have a license key or you don't have a dongle attached to this. I'm like, okay. I know that. So instead of double clicking on it, I'm going to right click and I'm going to view it in the reviewer. Okay, let's give that a second to pull that up. As we listen to some Christmas cheer in the background. Okay, so it's going to pull up this project underneath the reviewer. It's taken a little bit. Since it's got a point cloud in it, there's plenty of data that's that's getting pumped into this uh, into this project here. So we'll give it a second while we sip on some coffee. Got a nice dark roast going on today too. So that's always a, a good plus in the workday. Okay, it's all in there now. Just did a quick little burp to get that all in there quickly. But now, so this this is the other project that's underneath this workspace that I wanted to take a look at. So again, I like to coach you guys over to punch on this icon here and get the get the tree view showing up. So I'm going to burp, 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 work my way around this here with the left mouse click. I'm just kind of rotating about. And you can see in the background there is a little bit of some small circle content. But um, what that is, is it's made from the point cloud. So you can see that here now too, is underneath my data, instead of just a probing session, I've got a surface scan that's actually included in here as well. And again, you can uh, middle mouse button show, I'll push down middle mouse button show and hide, show and hide um, all of the uh, the CAD that's in here. And again, I can show and hide. You can see when I push that down, this point cloud is, is showing up or going away. So let's go like this. I'm gonna hide all the CAD. And here's what happens with the, uh, with the point cloud. You can show and hide that with that middle mouse button. So there were some issues with this, uh, with this, uh, this half of the, um, of the tool, this cavity half of the tool. So that's where the analysis came in and this was perfect. I could sit down with my client after they've pulled up all of the features that I've pulled from, from this analysis and then go through one piece at a time, middle mouse button push down. We can go through each of these, these circle contents now and find out why in the world is this Y component off by 15 thou. So again, just wanted to show you how you can navigate around in the workspace here. You can pick on whichever one of these projects or this multiple uh, projects if you had them underneath the workspace here and how you can make that go live 
is uh, as part of the reviewer. But without double clicking on it, you're going to need to go to that project and then view it in the workspace uh, or in the, the PolyWorks reviewer here.